and the, and the, year, and the duration of the contract, right? Okay. And then, oh, John, the other thing was the duration of the contract and the mileage from one way uh, to the city. I got the uh, duration right there. Just 24 months. Well, three of us like 24 months. We'll no, we're on Article 10. Anything else on Article 10? Yeah, I was on Article 10. Article 11. Article 11. Section 4, last sentence. Section 4, last sentence, yes. Office, um, let's see that. Officer, uh, city agrees to pay off the lump sum severance payment equal to the balance of the HR of the agreement by the loan event less than, it says 12 months salary benefits. And this is if he is terminated by city or police chief for any reason. Other reasons. Other reasons. Other reasons. Other suggestion by city or police chief. That he resigned before the expiration of the term of agreement. I'd like to make that one month. I make twelve months a little bit long. Mm -hmm. uh, one month, and I would like to add that benefits is usually like your insurance. It depends on which day of the month you usually quit. If it's at the end of the month, my insurance is at the end of the month, it stops. I quit on the first of the month, it carries me through. Pays all the way through, but then um, then they have the option of doing COPA. Okay? <coughs> I mean, does the city offer? I mean, the city has to yeah, offer that. Yeah, the city has to offer that. So, it has it has it has it so I think and benefits should be COPA. struck, you know, because. I would like to leave the benefits up here in my current bill. If I quit on the first, my benefits carry through the month. I think for something that happened to put on the first, and I have benefits this month. What you're doing, then, you're it's allowed. Read, then it's read, if you read it that way, then 12 months salary and benefits, then you've got a one month, one month salary and one month benefits. They're taking out <coughs> the teeth of value for his, uh, for his security. Mm -hmm. I think the, 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 the whims of a, of a three vote majority can fire him for one month salary. Yeah, John, I mean, uh, I agree with you on that. Uh, what this is saying here <coughs> is that if a new administration wanted to get rid of him for You're any reason, one month. see this is uh, see uh, uh, on this lead. This is other than just cause. That's right. This is not a termination. <laughs> this is a suggestion that you leave because we don't want to spend some money. You're allowing on you. the whims of let's say the concerned citizens come in here just firing like they discussed. You see, this is the most important clause in this I'm contract. Not going to read Twelve months. This, what you say. But this is the most important clause well, in this contract. Said. Did you hear what I said? I, I heard what you said. I may go more than a month, but I'm not going 12 months. I'll do that right now. Were you given the whim of a new council just to blow him off? No. Yes, I'm just saying. Well, that's, that's, that's the... Uh, that's the essence of the whole country. It sure is. It, this, there's read, security read it carefully what right you're there. saying. It doesn't allow a fruitcake to come in here and, and abandon it. That's the essence of the whole contract right there. That's okay. the most important part of that. And you know how whimsical people can be. You can read their, what their website to find out what they're doing. Can we change it for words again? We keep hearing the website all night long at this table, and it has really nothing Lee, to do with saying? this table. Is it? <laughs> Yes. Mm -hmm. If it's anything besides just cause, in other words, he hasn't done anything wrong. He hasn't done anything wrong. New council can say bye bye, and they like give the him days pay. Like his George's children get arrested for speeding or something, and she comes in and clamps together two people, and he's gone. If, if 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 we change that to one month, then we might as well just throw this contract away. That's not well, sure. That's, no, I'm just saying. I'm saying this contract was null and void. If we changed that to one month. I'm not even discussing. No, I don't agree with that. Right, your grandmother. Are y'all willing to come off for 12 months? I'm not coming off for 12 months. I'm not. I'm not going up to 12 months up here right now. All right. Let's and I think that's being physically responsible. I mean, that's what you're looking at. Is somebody? If it said four years, it would be different. But it says 12 months. And unemployment insurance is two years, so we're giving half of what unemployment insurance is. In addition to so we're offering Potter half of unemployment insurance because two years is what the federal government has approved already. So we're offering him half of the amount that we would have to pay him in unemployment insurance if the new administration just decided to can him for no apparent reason. We're offering him half unemployment right now. I think. I think. 
uh, Mike and I could probably work with, what would you say would be the maximum amount that you would want to give him to protect his security? Six months. Six months. Maybe $14,000. But if we had under pump and insurance and he this is going to if you're saying this is going to hamper us pass, if you can't go six months to twelve, let then me, we're supposed to have to Right. Let me ask you, do you have any reaction with Glenn? Uh, a sticking point we're having now is the time element that can be used to give him if he's arbitrarily just fired without circumstance. I don't think so. uh, in this, in this particular section of Article 11, Section 4, it has 12 months pay if he's just ceremoniously fired for whatever purpose, other than circumstances that you would find necessary to fire him. Do you see Glenn willing to stay with the city if he took a six month situation there? My contract states the remaining of, of the contract. So if I'm terminated for no reason, other than a just cause, the city has to pay the remaining of the contract. And, and you know, y'all may word it like that, and like Lee, I can understand Lee's concern, but if he works here a year, then if he's terminated for no reason, he can collect a year. But if he works here a year and a half, the city don't want to him six months, but that's why my worried. Well, this contract's contract. a little bit of um, more giving to the city his first, if he's fired within his first year, because it's only asking for 12 months salary after the fact he's fired. So yeah, uh, and you know, and it's a t and we're we're on a 24 month contract. What we're looking at now, so this basically gives the security aspect to him that he's not just fired for political reasons other than a reason of being drunk on the job or something that you would have to fire him off of. So what I'm asking you, knowing Potter the way you do, Lee will not go over six months. Yeah. And we're going to and, be and see, the way I see that, this is my opinion, you know, 12 months, you know, I, it's not Potter's fault. If, if he gets, if he comes out here and does something wrong against general orders or whatever, and in his contract he's terminated, you know, that's on him. But now the city comes in and fires him for no reason. That shouldn't fall on y'all shoulders because y'all, you know. Well, Lee's well, looking for the future of the city. I, I know, you know, when the Potter's big deal is, it's, 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 they just come is. in and terminate him for no reason. Well, you know. I still think six months benefits the salary pretty damn generous. It's either take it or leave it. I don't have that Six months is it. Mike, can you go six months? What are you getting? We're going to get this board time. Well, I know what's going to happen, so. You just don't have to do it. Well, we're getting something. Because when we're done, we're not going to get anything. But you know. I know. All right, John, you make the money. Let's go ahead. We're going to see if Tatum is done. No, we're almost there. We're almost there. No, we're almost there, Mike. We're almost there. 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 we are almost there we are almost there we are almost there we <laughs> can't believe you said you're, that. Well, you, you're saying. I don't want to hear the argument. Can I? I, I, no, I can don't want to hear. Can I say something? No, I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear. I'm not. I'm telling you, we go six months. We're not going to do it at all. You're saying that you're going to. I'm not going to hear it. An officer for <laughs> no just cause, and then you're going to give him six months. I'm going to put that down, and we're going to vote under this circumstance. I, I understand why what you're saying. No, I just don't I agree with that. No, that. I don't agree well. with that because if it was, if you fired it for a just cause, yeah, get ready. But if it's not a just cause, and you're gonna, you're gonna, uh, I want to try terminate to get... him for no reason at all and give him six months pay. I don't agree with that. Mike, would you give him something? I think what Table is saying. I don't think we need to take because you're not going to change your opinion. You know. Let me tender a.
of the audience. Do y'all have any comments, just a real quick snippet of thought that we can use to guide us? Because we're here to represent you folks as well. I do. Or that's what we're here for. I do. If you fire anybody for unjust cause, they're going to sue you. And it's going to cost you more than six months. It's going to cost you more than 12 months, whatever. So again, it don't matter what you put in the, in the contract, you sue, you fire well, somebody unjustly. And he proves it's unjustly. It's going to cost you more than I know than Ricky anybody. Bell used to be a cop here, was fired unjustly. He got hundreds of thousands. That's what I'm telling you. So y'all are, are bickering over six months, 12 months, whatever. If well, it's truly but, unjust, it's not going to matter what you put in there that you're going to give him. He's going to take you to the cleaners and well, sue you. Well, what, what but this under, under this Article 11, it's three different avenues that, that he can go go through to be reinstated. I mean, even if we terminate him, if this is passed, if he's discharged, he can go before an arbitrator, three people. Then he can take it to district court. That's they can be overturned at any time. That all cost him money he may not have. He's just needing to have a clarity in his contract. You're asking, asking him to take on a burden now. But, Don, addressing you before I go to Phil Rutledge, if you put in here an agreement that he agrees to, he doesn't have the right of suit if you're giving him what he asked for. If you do fire him without just cause, he's agreed to take 12 months and walk away. I'm yes. telling you, you can put the unjust cause in there. I have been dealing with people like that for years. You can write in there anything you want to, and he can sign it, but I'm telling you, he has the right to sue he you. He does have the right. And the state you have Texas, a right to sue for anything, but a contractual agreement would guarantee him the 12 months. But the state of Texas is going to tell you that you've overstepped your bounds because that is determined by the labor laws. But he is, this is a contractual agreement. He is agreeing to 12 months. His or contract, or severance his, if he's his contract cannot override the state of Texas law. I got all for you. Take your leave. He gets 12 months if it's proven in court that he was fired unjustly or let go or terminated, whatever. So, in other words, you're saying that deal or no deal? Deal or no deal? I don't understand what you're saying. Take it. In other words, if, if, if it's six months, no argument, 12 months with argument. That's right. I want the man to have, uh, I want the man if to be treated. If you want 12 months, on the level we'll agree to it. If it's proven, if we're right here, prove it in court that he was unjustly terminated. Well, then we're paying court costs. Uh, Phil, what do you have to comment? I was just going to make the comment that depending on the time frame that you set there, based on, I know you hate the word mayor, the budget constraints. I mean, the city of Kemp just shut down their entire police department because of no money. Now you're saying if, if something happened like that, you know, we pray it doesn't, but we all know what's happening in Tyler. We all know what's happening in other places. The revenues are going to drop. There's no doubt in my mind about that. I mean, sales tax revenues. Rep, sales not tax revenues. Municipal court revenues necessarily. Yeah. Last time I looked, and the mayor showed me the court revenues were way down from budget. So I don't know what if they're I up now. I, I got it. I got it. Would yeah. y'all please stop using the court revenue as revenue? That is. Oh, y'all yeah. can't. You we can't. can't even right. discuss that. We can't yeah. talk about that. I got so, you, Judge. So, anyway, that's my only comment. Six months is a long time for a good cop. He should not have an issue getting a job in today's world well, somewhere age, else. His age is going to start playing out. Uh, any other comment from the city? So in other words, in other words, if wait a minute, somebody, wait a minute. I was asking the city people. <coughs> any other comments, folks? Okay, Mike, go ahead. So in other words, if a uh, new administration comes in here and just decides to axe his job for no apparent reason, then you're saying to compensate him for the 12 months. If it's proved in court, it was unjustified. Well, it would be because I, I, any well, the last I would agree with that because that's that's a no-brainer, as the mayor likes to say. I mean, you know, nobody's going to fire him without a reason. Well, that, but that's that's all. You think it Yes. I mean, I, mean, uh, I don't know. These, okay. these you know, seem you know, to be concerned that a new council is going to take over and come in and fire everybody. <laughs> Well, I don't know why, Pam, but Pam, that's I, where they come from. Pam, I would just make my concern public. Uh, a shift in the budget could be a just cause to get rid of Potter. 
you may want to spend more on something else instead of his salary as the police officer, and that would be a just cause to terminate him. And I don't agree with that because this man's putting his life on the line every day for the city, and then we give him no guarantee whatsoever. Well, you know, just, not, not just, everybody gets a guarantee. We're but, looking at but, everybody but and we're this, talking but about... But is that true, Pam, that you could adjust the budget and no, get rid of the no, car? No, we're not talking about that. No, no I mean, no. is that the case? Could that happen? Could, could the budget be adjusted well, and Potter lose his job? Yeah, and not only that, but it's well, We're talking about Potter here. We're talking about Potter here. No, we're talking about the budget. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. You're not enjoying it? All right, let's go. Why would I see about Potter as to somebody else? I don't know. Budget could be adjusted. He could be terminated. All right, here's the deal we're doing right now. Girls, I'm sorry for taking so long. Here's, here's the situation we're dealing with now. Like, you can hold it up. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, you're right. 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 Yeah, you're the size of the city. I say to let that stand. Well, I'd be going the other way instead of reducing it. She's thinking about the... Uh, I'm not asking about reducing it. I'm well, just saying that's what it does would, not need to be in there. Well, if you put that in there, that clause in there, then it could be reduced. You don't have a problem with it. I don't have a problem I think with it. Does anybody else not have a problem? I just need three votes. Is there a third vote for not having a problem with that reading as I it is? I do not have a problem with it. Either. 
Very good. We got three. Next thing. Okay. We're fixing to have a vote on this. Where's our mayor? Can I join in? Please. <laughs> mayor, would you please call a vote? And then we're going to. All right, at this time, I'll take a motion on the uh, contract with the necessary correction would be the wording. I'm going to make, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make the motion, and Angela, you're going to have to write this so we can get it of record. Okay. Okay. I make a motion we accept this contract with the following changes. Article 1, Section 1, substitute four years for two years. Two, two years. Two years. Yes. Before. Vice versa. Article. Yeah, I did. Article 10. In Article 10, take home police or patrol vehicle. Said vehicle station not exceeding 30 miles from city limits. Not to exceed 30 miles from city limits. One way. One way. Thank you. That's a good. One. When you're ready, I'll go to the next. Okay, I'm ready. Article 11, Section 4, last line of Section 4. We're changing it from 12 months to six months. Okay. That is how I'm, I'm uh, wording that uh, motion. That we make a motion with those changes that I just mentioned okay. to accept this contract as written. Okay. We have a second. And it's been a second. Any other questions? Hopefully, hell no. Questions? Questions? All in favor? Three. All in favor? Two. two. All opposed, how to say? Two. Two opposed and three for that is a done deal. I could have did that from the beginning. So all that this squad, you know, both well, going to come out. He got through it, Yeah, yeah. ran people off, but you did. But anyway, okay. that's your right. So, okay. Let's move on. What else you going to do? You going to call for the city? This is what's happening around here. NBA is fantastic. Let's go. All right, let's go through the, to the budget. No, we're on uh, number seven. Oh, I'm sorry, hold on. The city of Nacrophone newspaper. Frank's the newspaper will become our official newspaper again. Next. Do you want us to vote on it? No. We can. Y'all yeah, want to vote on it? I'll make a motion. We accept Frank's newspaper as being our go to paper for announcements. I'll I'll second. second. Then motion second. Then first question, first question. All in favor? Okay. Unanimous, Angela? Yeah. Budget. Budget. You. you know what? I'm going to get a chance to show my movie tonight because I don't want to keep y'all here. I'm mm -hmm. about five minutes. I don't want to see it. Okay, well, I'll do that after this. I'll do that after this then. It's real funny. Okay. It's about your friend over there in Lollipop. All right, let me tell you what I did. You should have three three items in front of you. One should be year to date. It's got YTD on there, if you don't understand what that means. One is the budget from last year. It's got the dates on there. And one is the uh, budget that I did for this year. I'm sorry, I didn't do it. Me and Shalina did it. And all I did was took what we've done year to date, from right now, what we have spent today, to this date, added a small percentage for the next two months, and called that the budget for next year. It's very plain, very simple. And if you look at it, Mr. Rutledge, were you part of this budget committee last year? Yes, I was. And if you look at it, I, 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 I told Shalina that it is great that I think over the whole budget we're within like $3,000, three to five, somewhere in there. We, we nailed it, in other words. That budget from last year, it did real well. It did real well. So all I did was took the year to date, projected two more months, myself and Shalina, and we made that into the budget for next year. Now, here's the deal. We're going to have a hangover. This year, just like we did last year, we budgeted 27000 for the community center. But out of that 27000 
We have not spent but the 12-5, the matching funds that we had to spend, 12-5. The other 14-5 is in my account, Southside. I've taken, I don't to do this on the marriage report, but I've taken some additional funds and put it over there in that Southside account where we're reading 24 to 25,000 right now. Okay, well, I'm gonna see it right now. We're taking in bids to finish the community center off. Right now, we've got one company that's physically telling us that we're going to need about 50,000. I've already got 25. So if we do this budget like we did it last year and hold the rest of it up against the CD, we can easily finish the community center and be done with it. Are we going to pay two hundred fifty thousand no. dollars come September? Yes, sir. Y'all will. I'll be high. They don't offer an extension on that. Well, we've already put fire chief already asked me to put in an extension, right? Right. You just got to sign. I've already asked to put in an extension, but like I said, once this budget is approved and you let me use that, like we did last year, that that ending amount against the CD, I can get the building done. Just like this year. We didn't spend the twenty-seven thousand. Let me say it again. I spent twelve five matching funds we had to spend. The other fourteen is still in the bank. So we, we we didn't spend that money. It's not spent. So I'm gonna let you because of all this discussion, he say, she say, and all that stuff y'all did today. Well, we ain't gonna be talking about this budget today. We'll talk about this next month. Okay. So you got time to go home? You got well, yes, Mr. Rudd. Would you mind, sir, if I got a copy of what you've got so just I could compare it to last year's? Sure. Okay. No problem. So that's what I did. You want to copy all three of them? Or you already got two of them, right? Uh, I'm not sure. I guess all three just to be sure. All right. And so we're not going to talk about this thing because we spent a whole lot of time on something else. Okay? But that, you have it in your hands. Go ahead and, 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 and see what you got to do. But I'm telling you right now, when we come in here for the June meeting, and if, if you don't agree with 90% or whatever, what we'll do is we'll just go have a budget workshop because we're not going to hold this damn meeting here this long anymore. We'll have to argue the squad, you know. And, and that's a good thing. That's what you're supposed to do. We're not going to come back and get some more. We'll just hold budget hearings if we don't come to a compromise for the next meeting. If I got a problem with that. Oh, no. Is this movie time or going number nine? Uh, I ain't going to say it. Number nine. Number nine. Unless you want me to. No, but after me. Huh? After me. Okay. After the meeting? Yes. Okay. Yes, I want to see it. It's, uh, what's the name? I want to see it. Is it fun? It's a man here. Yeah? Okay. I'll take it. Okay. It's a man here. I'll be. I'm saying. Okay. Well, all right. All right. All right. Give me a bag of box. Okay. Well, anyway, let's, let's move on then. Okay. The annual Tamer meeting Saturday, June the 9th. I think one of us, if not all of us, some of us, we need to go. Where's the sound? It's in Maybank. Right? I don't know. Is it in Maybach? Maybach is on the other side of Athens. Yes. Way on the other side. You know where high school is? Yeah. It's like going to Dallas. It is. Right down 175. Yeah. So, I'm just letting you know that somebody, some of us need to go and, and, and see what Tamer's doing. Uh, at the top of my head, they were requesting a 62% raise, and they settled for 14%. In other words, Monarch was trying to kill us with 62%. I'm not sure about this newspaper, man, but I'm pretty close. Yeah, right. Am I right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, right. Okay, 62%, so they settled for 14%. What does that mean? We still got yeah, it's a good word. Well, can, I, can I make a statement on this? And I don't know if everybody has been following the water bills as close as I have. And this, and I've talked to Mr. about this fact some time ago. I have one piece of property. I, I have contacted Monarch 18 times on one piece of property. Now, this is what happened. They may have got, they didn't get their 60-something percent increase in their water. But what they did. Yeah, John. I mean, uh, I agree with you on that. Uh, what this is saying here <coughs> is that if a new administration wanted to get rid of him for You're any reason, one month. see, this is, uh, see, uh, uh, on this lead, this is other than just cause. That's right. This is not a termination. <laughs> this is a suggestion that you leave because we don't want to spend some money We're on you. We're allowing the whims of 
just say the concerned citizens come in here perspiring like they discussed. You see, this, this is the most important clause in this I'm contract. I'm not going to read 12 months. This, what you say. But this is the most important clause well, in this contract. Said. Did you hear what I said? I, I heard know. what you said. I may go more than a month, but I'm not going 12 months. I'll do that right now. Were you given the whim of a new council just to blow him off? No. Yes, I'm just understanding. Well, that's 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 the. Uh, that's the essence of the whole country. It sure is. It, this there's Please, security line. Be careful what right you're there. saying. It does. One month, make twelve months a little bit long. Mm -hmm. uh, one month, and I would like to add that benefits is usually like your insurance. It depends on which day of the month you use. If it's at the end of the month, my insurance at the end of the month, it stops. If I quit on the first of the month, it carries it through. Page all the way through, but then um, then they have the option of doing COPA. Okay? <coughs> I mean, does the city offer? I mean, the city has to offer yeah, that. The city has to so. it's, it's 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 so I think at benefits it's should be struck, you know, because. I would like to leave the benefits to the of my current bill. If I quit on the first, my benefits carry through the month. I think for something happened to me put a first and I have been this this month. What you're doing is you're allowed. Then it's read, if you read it that way, then 12 months salary and benefits, then you've got a one month. One month salary and one month benefits. They're taking out <coughs> the teeth of value for his uh, for his security. Mm -hmm. I think the, 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 the whims of a, of a three vote majority can fire him for one month. I'm not coming off 12 months. I mean, I'm, not, I'm not going up to 12 months. All right. Let's See, turn. and I think that's being fiscally responsible. I mean, that's what you're looking at. If somebody, if, if it said four to, years, it would be different. But it says 12 months. And unemployment right. insurance is two years, so we're giving half of what unemployment insurance is. In addition to. So we're offering Potter half of unemployment insurance because two years is what the federal government has approved already. So we're offering him half of the I amount just, that we would have to pay him in unemployment insurance. If the new administration just decided to can him for no apparent reason, we're offering him half the employment right now. I think, this. I think uh, Mike and I could probably work with what would you say would be the maximum amount that you would want to give him to protect his security? Six months. Six months. $14,000. But if we. And the, and the year and the duration of the contract, right? Okay. And then, oh, John, the other thing was the duration of the contract and the mileage from one way uh, to the city. I got the uh, duration. Yeah, just 24 months. Well, three of us like 24 months. No, we're on Article 10. Anything else on Article 10? I was on Article 10. Article 11. Article 11, Section 4, last sentence. Section 4, last sentence, yes. Office, um, let's see that. Officer, uh, city agrees to pay off the lump sum severance payment equal to the balance of the HR of the agreement, but the no loan event less than, it currently says 12 months salary and benefits. And this is if he is terminated by city or police chief for any reason, other reasons, other reasons, other formal <coughs> suggestion by city or police chief. That he resigned before the expiration of the first of the agreement. I'd like to make it. Doesn't allow a fruitcake to come in here and, and abandon it. That's the essence of the whole contract right there. That's okay. the most important part of that. And you know how whimsical people can be. You can read their, what their website to find out what they're doing. <laughs> We change it to and we keep hearing the website all night long at this table, and it has really nothing Lee, to do with this table. Is it? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's anything besides just cause. In other words, he hasn't done anything wrong. He hasn't done anything wrong. New council can say bye bye, and they like give the him days pay. Like this George's children get arrested for speeding or something, and she comes in and clamps together two people, and he's gone. It, it, if, if, if we change that to one month, then we might as well just throw this contract away. That's not really Well, sure. That's, John. Oh, that's John. No, yeah, I'm just saying, I'm saying this contract is null and void if we change that to one month. Yeah, might as well not even discuss it. No, I don't agree with that. Right, it's your grandmother. Are y'all willing to come off at 12 months? 